Given the function f of x equal to x squared plus 3x minus 4, we are asked to calculate the area delimited by this function, the vertical straight lines x equal to minus 1 and x equal to 3, and the x axis. Axis, I'm sorry. For that, we will use integrals and in the first place we have to know the sign of this function from x equal to minus 1 and till x equal 3 that is just knowing what the function does between those two lines and for this let's make the function equal 0 x squared plus 3x minus 4 equals 0 and as it is a second degree equation applying the formula that is minus 3 plus minus the square root of 3 squared is 9 minus 4 times 1 times minus 4 divided by 2 times 1 that is 2 so we would have minus 3 plus minus the square root of 25 would be 5 divided by 2 and the answers would be minus 3 plus 5 divided by 2 and minus 3 minus 5 divided by 2 and that is equal to minus 3 plus 5 is 2 divided by 2 is 1 and minus 3 minus 5 divided by 2 is minus 4 so we want to know the area from x equal to minus 1 until x equal 3 the values where the function is equal 0 are 1 and minus 4 the minus 4 would be right here out of from where we want to calculate the area so we don't have to take it into account and the 1 would be right here in the middle So, let's study the sign of the function in this interval right here from minus 1 to 1 and on the interval from 1 to 3. So, let's substitute a value between minus 1 and 1, that, that can be a 0, and the value between 1 and 3 would be a 2. Let's substitute these values into the function to know if the function here is positive or negative. In 0, the function would be 0 squared plus 3 times 0 minus 4, that is equal to minus 4, negative. And in 2, that would be 2 squared plus 3 times 2 minus 4, that is equal to 4 plus 6 minus 4 equals 6, positive. So, for doing the integral, we we will obtain a negative number between minus 1 and 1 so in this interval we will have to change the signs of the result of the integral so the area is positive and on from 1 to 3 the integral would be positive so there's no problem with that So, let's erase this down here, and let's calculate the integrals. So, the area would be equal to, from minus 1 till 1, that is the integral, of the function x squared plus 3x minus 4 d of x and here let's make the absolute value so that changes the the sign from negative to positive and from 1 to 3 the integral of the function again d of x again we will do the absolute value Now let's calculate apart the integrals 
just that's just integrating monomials. X squared would be x cube divided by three. Three x would be three x squared divided by two, and minus four would be minus four x plus the constant. But we does not need to take into account the constant because we don't have our integrals are definite integrals. So down here we have the absolute value and the result of the integral x cubed divided by 3 plus 3x squared divided by 2 minus 4x between minus 1 and 1 plus the same the result of the integral between 1 and 3 and we just have to substitute the values into the functions so we would have let's substitute the the first value the the one so one cube divided by three plus three times one square divided by two minus four times one minus and now we have to substitute the minus one minus one cube divided by three plus three times minus one square divided by two minus 4 times minus 1 plus the other part of the integral we, has, we have to substitute the 3 first so we would have 3 cubed divided by 3 plus 3 times 3 squared divided by 2 minus 4 times 3 minus and now we just have to substitute the 1 1 cubed divided by 3 plus 3 times 1 squared divided by 2 minus 4 times 1 and we just have to operate everything and, and as we have no space left I'm going to leave it to do it by yourself if you want leave a comment with the results and I'll tell you if you're right or not